I pay 12,000 rupees every month for this small apartment that I live in and I'm gonna tell you why. So basically here's where I keep my shoes when we enter the apartment on the left side. I have three pair of shoes. This one has been with me for like five years. This one for like six years and uh, this one I recently bought. I don't know why did I buy this. I mean I had to buy this because of my office thing. Uh, I have to wear formals for my office. This is my workout shoes and this one is my casual shoes. Oh this is the broom. I don't use it much only for like cleaning my room and stuff. If I was living with my mom, this would have been used uh, a lot more because she would have used it to beat the shit out of me. Anyway, this is a storage area. <laughs> what the fuck? So this is a wardrobe. I keep my clothes in here, not very organized. Some clothes, hair oil and stuff. And I have a big mirror, uh, not so clean. I'm a bachelor living alone, what do you expect? and uh, there's some storage space up there this is how it looks and below this i always keep it here this is where i sit and meditate every morning like for 15 minutes so this always stays there this is my meditation space now coming to the best part of my studio apartment my bed the bed is very comfortable this is where the magic happens because sleep is a magical thing and uh, i did not buy this bed i had to rent this bed and also the bed frame uh, it costed me around 5000 rupees for 9 months i rented them both from berlin co i got a great deal because if i were to buy these two they would have cost me around 20000 rupees together uh, that's my estimate i don't know how right i am but uh, yeah and this blanket i had to buy this and uh, I had to buy those pillows as well and this bed sheet as well and I have kept a lamp over there and this is where I shoot my YouTube videos so I, I wanted to make this background as nice as possible so I kept a few books over there my guitar always stays there and that lamp is beautiful it's around 450 500 rupees I guess and that bed stand I got it from Ikea I actually ordered it and uh, it costed me around 800 rupees I guess I don't know I'm not sure I want to put something on the wall so I'm planning to put a word map back in my home in my room I have a word map on my wall I love that word map I want to do the same thing here to make this background look even better and this is where I work from chair is making too much noise okay so this is my work setup all right I have my laptop keyboard and my mouse my notepad a water bottle I always have a transparent water bottle on my table filled with water I mean I drink a lot of water by the way this is my chair I bought this for around 3500 rupees I was not going to compromise with chair because I spend around 10 hours in a day on this chair and I wanted this to be a good chair and this is the table I just keep this table on the side to keep other things and my work laptop this is where my work laptop usually stays and when i'm working it goes over there and that laptop shifts here and i have two of my specs boxes and i keep the books that i'm reading here on the side so that i can just pick it up and start reading and my amplifier stays here all the time because i just want to pick up my guitar and directly plug it and start playing and i have my cable situation i can manage my cables better i guess but yeah and this one with pen pencil highlighter etc and my eye drops and this one my mic always stays here so i can just put it out i can just connect this to that and start talking here because i don't want a lot of friction between my free time and my working time what i mean to say is if i want to record something i just want to be able to like you know record it in two three minutes so i just keep my mic here so that it's easy for me to record things so this is how my work setup looks like not very fancy but it works for me and by the way this table was here and this table was here i moved this table here i switched their positions because I wanted more sunlight as you can see I get plenty of sunlight from this window so throughout the day I wanted sunlight so that my sleep gets better so yeah I did that now from my work setup to my kitchen I don't cook I have a cook so she cooks here this one I bought this and I have plenty of storage space here here and I have a window here and my water always stays there 
I store my vegetables over there and a sink. It has some dirty dishes. So I have a lot of storage actually. I don't have much to show in the kitchen. This is a simple kitchen, works for me. Now I'll show you my bathroom. I have a geyser given to me. I don't have any problem with the hot water. It is an electric geyser, always works, pretty cool. Bathroom is very compact. I have a shower, my tap, sink, one more dirty mirror bachelor living alone what do you expect the mirrors are always dirty and uh, yeah there's nothing much to show here actually because this is a very small bathroom very modern actually the building is very new so yeah i'm happy with it i'm gonna show you the best part of my apartment and it's not even in my apartment Best part of my apartment is the terrace. <laughs> the view from here is beautiful. I just come up here and spend my time here. I don't think I can ever get sick of this view. This is that beautiful. Ah. And if I come up here on the water tank, the view just gets better. Check out this view at night. This is my stress buster actually. I just come up here, take a deep breath and my stress kind of goes away. Okay, now you might be wondering why do I pay 12,000 rupees for such a small space? There are a few reasons. First one, this is very near to my office. If I go in search of a cheaper place and I start living far away, I will have to spend that much amount of money just for, you know, traveling. That's reason one. The second reason is the gym is very nearby. It's like two minutes walk from my place. So it's very convenient for me. And the most important reason is the neighborhood is really good. It is very silent, it's very calm and uh, the people living here are like really good. And I have almost anything that I need within the 500 meter radius. So considering all the factors, I think paying 12,000 rupees is uh, worth it for me. Let me know your opinion. Subscribe. Bye.